Singing and dancing, women welcoming their governor, Samuel Otom, who is in Morn, a district in Kwande local council area of Benue State, to meet with the two warring parties. They fled their homes since 2013 following headsmen attacks. On the other side are youths and students carrying placards, seeking immediate resolution of all disputes and the safe return to their ancestral homes. It's a peace meeting with the state government, the Mon community, the headsmen and security men. While the leadership of Mon IDPs want adequate troops deployed to keep the peace, the headsmen are promising peaceful coexistence with their host communities. We wish to request His Excellency to make adequate security arrangements that would ensure self return of people to their ancestral homes. We need to tell our people that they should buy by the citizen, they should give peace to reign in this place so that the other people or community of Bionic State to come back to their various places. The leadership of both parties are thereafter reunited by Governor Otom, who asked them to embrace peace. I want to assure more people that I'm not going to establish IDP camp. You are going to go back to your ancestral home as for today. And there is not going to be any crisis again. Nobody is going to attack anyone. The Flammy people are not going to attack more people again. And more people are not going to attack Flammy again. So that all of us will live in peace. Beside the crisis of displacement, wood merchants have illegally converted the Abadji primary school destroyed by headsmen into a timber shed where assorted woods are processed for exports to China and Europe. This worries the governor. We have banned the falling of these trees. Now, with the restoration of peace in this community, we are going to enforce the law. Both those people who are coming to buy and those who are perpetuating it, who are within this community, will be apprehended. While communities in Mon district seek a better future, as the state government begins their reintegration program, a timely arrest of indiscriminate deforestation activities will help preserve the environment.